we're going to have a look at this tutorial. So this is our, our introduction to uh, telecommunications uh, using Python. So in this one, we'll just uh, look at some simple translations for our data types. So we should find the tutorial is here. And so for the first one, what we've got to do is to be able to determine the conversion from decimal into binary, ASCII, and so on. Okay, so we'll just open up the first one, and we need to find the conversions for 55 decimal. Okay, so we'll just try this program here. And we'll just open up the first first one and then just paste that in and there's our little program that we have okay so all that's going to happen is that we're going to pass in an argument which go into value one it'll print the decimal value binary hex octal and the actual character okay so control x and we'll just commit and then we've got python and that's it there okay so if we pass in an argument such as 55 it should actually give us the values that we're looking for. Okay, so that's the first one. Uh, what we find is that in Python, 0b identifies binary, 0x identifies hex, a 0 in front of it identifies octal, and the character for 55 decimal is uh, character 7. Okay, so let's look at the second challenge. So with this one we're going to use the shift operator. Uh, so the value we're looking at is 44 shifted. So we'll just grab the Python code here. We'll call this tutorial 2. We'll paste that in. Okay, so if we have a look, uh, here's the program. Okay, so we, we enter a value, we show the, in this case, the binary form. Of it, and then we'll show the, the decimal value. And this is where we do a shift to the left, and then a shift to the left two places, and then a shift to the right. Okay, so what we'll do is that uh, we'll input the value either as a decimal or as a binary value. So we just have a look. So the value is 42. So we have an integer. Okay, so the decimal format is there. Okay, so that's our decimal value. And then we're printing it out in binary and also in, in decimal. So this is our binary here. So this will take off the 0b that we see at the start. And then it will, this one bit will pad the binary value with uh, zeros. Okay, so there we go. So then a uh, uh, 44 uh, is this in, in binary. And we can see when we shift that by one place, then we get a value of 88. That's it shifted by two positions, and then that's it shifted right by one, and then two positions. Okay. So the next one, what we'll do is we'll look at some Boolean operations. Uh, so the equation we've got is A and B, or not C. So let's see if we can 
Grab that. Okay, so here's our code. Let's copy that. And we'll paste that in. And so what we have is A and B. Or and our operator for or is that or not C. find the right character. What we'll do is we'll just copy that one. It's probably easier. Okay, so it's A or B or not C. So we'll just check. So it's A and B or not C. So that's that becomes a one for the not C part. So that's correct. Okay. So that's that's how we do that one. So next we'll look at uh, how we can perform bit operations on integers. So we just enter our code here. And we can just do it manually. Uh, you can also p put in another argument if you want. Okay, so we'll just check we've got the right values there. That's fine. And there's the bitwise and, there's NAND, and so on. So the NAND should be the inverse of AND, and the NOR should be the inverse of the OR. Okay, so now we'll look at uh, bit masking. So this is going to display all our 
bitmask values in the range of 0 to 255. And that's the result there. <coughs> Okay, so uh, this is the value, and then this is the mask here. And for the for this one, we just copy and paste from the PDF. Unfortunately, we need to put in the need to put in the indents. And that's it. Okay, so we'll just give it a try and we'll see if it works. And there's our result there. Okay, uh, so that's really just been an introduction to, to the Python tutorials.